all over the uh, news, we it is time we're going to lose an African, one of the African icons. These uh, these are people that have worked so hard for Mad Africa, but then the, we we just stand up. It is time. Amen. Amen. Say we thank God. It is time. Robert Mugabe, the former president of Zimbabwe, has died at the age of 95. Mugabe was at the center of his country's struggle for independence and became its first prime minister in 1980 before becoming president seven years later. His reputation as a hero of the independence movement was overshadowed, though, by the corruption and human rights abuses which marred his time in power, and his policies caused the collapse of Zimbabwe's economy. He was forced from office by his own party in 2017. Shingai Nioka looks back at his life. He was once Zimbabwe's liberator, leading a war against white minority rule. But by the end, the adulation President Robert Mugabe once enjoyed was gone. He cemented his power, winning overwhelmingly at elections in 1980. As leader of a new nation, he set about creating a better country than the one he inherited. And for a while, he succeeded. Mugabe deployed a crack military unit to southern Zimbabwe to deal with hundreds of insurgents. Between 1983 and 1987, thousands were murdered and the world turned a blind eye. Mugabe was the great hope. Hard fight for Gazis. To his excellency, Comrade Emerson Nangagwa, and the people of Zimbabwe, for the passing away of our brother and colleague in the common struggle. His excellency, Comrade Robert Mugabe.